I took a nap Wednesday, October 18, 2023. Dream vlog. Uh, so I took a nap and I just woke up. It's like 1.30 in the morning. Um, 1.38. Oh, I just looked. Um, so I dreamt there was two houses next to each other. And they were off like a highway. Yeah. It was like a, off a road that was like a, a road. I want to say highway, but it's like a, a road with nothing but like grass and trees around it like farming area and all that stuff and it was two houses on to the off to the left of the road it reminded me of the road from independence to salem to the highway and the freeway but it was like a, that kind of road and um there was two houses right next to each other each of them had um, trees around it and you had to pull in the driveway Pull in the rock area, the driveway, and go a little bit way, a little bit down the hill, and a little bit down into the driveway to get to the house. Both of them were like that. They were both set up like that. I dreamt that I, uh, I was in one of them, and it was like cartel or North Daniels or something like that, and they were tripping, and um, and anyways. They were trying to set me up as, uh, uh, they were trying to set me, they were hacking my stuff. Someone was hacking my stuff. I don't know, it was weird. And it, one house was, like, the, the bad people, the cartel or Daniels or whatever. And then the other house was, um, the other house was, like, our house, the one on, the, the house on the left, when I was, fa if I was standing on the road and I was facing facing the houses the house on the left was the bad house and the house on the right was our house like and jason diltz was in my dream helping me and so was my sister she was worried um they were worried um so i went into the house on the left and uh i was talking to somebody i remember dreaming of the, about, the, about that full bobby from tiktok west side bobby which is probably not even him in my dream it's just i've been watching his tiktoks so he just represented it, you know what I mean, in my dreams, a Mexican fool. But anyways, um, I walk in the house and I come back out. I go back to my house, which is the house on the right. And um, and uh, they start tripping. And then, uh, and then, um, and then, um, and then I go inside and I'm, I'm chilling in my room. I have a room there, I have my TV there, I have a computer there, and all that was, uh, my computer was getting hacked, and they were going through all my information with the spyware. They were using the spyware to go through all my information. I really have spyware on my computer, and it was put there by um, Reboot Computers in Salem, Oregon, without permission. So they put spyware and, and viruses in my computer without permission, so if I sue them, I can take over their whole business because that's illegal highly illegal hacking is highly illegal highly highly illegal F federal crimes federal crimes that's you can steal your whole identity with that way because you have all your emails all your social media on the computer all everything every information every password um banking information um paypal's information all that so the spyware can see everything on the screen so that's highly illegal that means they could steal my whole identity so um so if i sue them i can take over their whole business and get a lot of money but anyways um they put it on there i have spyware on my computer in real life i already have documentation of that and everything but anyways um anyways i was uh um i was uh that's why i keep my computer off because i don't want to let it sit out you know what i mean but anyways i let um um i was in the house and i was my computer was on and it started popping up um it started being remotely controlled like something was happening on my computer it was being remote remote controlled remote controlled on the computer and then um and then uh and then um i need to hire a lawyer but i don't have money to hire a lawyer right now um if I hire a lawyer, I'll get a big ass settlement and not just from reboot computers, from Best Buy, from everywhere. But anyways, um, 
um anyways i was uh i was in the house and i was going on my computer or i mean i was chilling and the computer started this i could see everything on the screen they were using remote access to access all my stuff on the screen and um and sometimes when i log into my facebook from my computer it locks my whole facebook down for 24 hours i don't know why it does that but it does and then yesterday in real life i left my computer on i turned on my computer and my whole facebook was shut down for 24 hours and i did not log into my facebook but it could have been a background access that the hackers were logging in my facebook from my computer which was weird but anyways that was real life anyways um in the dream they were bringing remote access to my uh to my uh to my computer jason diltz walks in and he's like talking to me and he's trying to help me he's like what's going on he just acted like he came in and he was just started like plugging in moving a speaker and putting stuff on my computer and my charger was right there and i was sitting on my bed and he was just looking at my computer he's looking at me he's like what's going on i was like i I was like i don't know they're just hacking me and i had and then on my computer i said a file there was a file made in my brother's name a whole file on my computer with my brother's name on it and i had some info on my brother and then i had another other files and then they were typing on my computer in, in my dreams they were typing on my computer they were typing on my computer right on the screen and it was coming on it was saying stuff that i did or that they thought i did and they were trying to frame me as a weirdo right against like a two-year-old and against other like weird shit and they were saying stuff on the screen and then um and then and then I was like, yeah, they hacked my webcam and all that stuff. I have proof of the computer trying to hack my webcam through Pandora. It, uh, my antivirus caught it. And they said it, they were trying to hack my, hack my webcam. And it, it blocked access to the backdoor access to the application of Pandora to block the, block the webcam access. It was uh, So they were trying to spy on me through the webcam. And I have real life information of that too. Documented. It's posted everywhere. And then, um, and then, um, and then, but that was real life. But anyways, um, they were just spying on me, trying to blackmail me, basically trying to blackmail me, scare me, scare me with blackmail. And, and, um, and now Jason, Jason was in my dreams trying to help me. Um, and he was like, uh, he was like looking at my computer. He's about to plug stuff into my computer and in my dream, it was not a desktop it was like a computer screen with a monitor and then it had a big, big old um i don't know what it's called but you know how com- real computers have the big old box with the cd-rom and everything that's what i had in my dream i don't have one of those but anyways it had one of these cd-rom things and the whole big old monitor the monitor and the the computer part i don't know what it's called where it has all the wires plugged into it it had one of those and jason jason was in my room like plugging stuff into it and inside and we were talking, I was like, can you find out, can you hack them? And can you reverse, can you reverse engineer their hacking and find out who they are? And he was like, yeah, I can do that. And we'll stop it and we'll tell them to leave you alone. Um, we'll tell them to leave you alone. And we won't, we won't expose them. If they leave me alone, the hackers leave me alone. We won't have to expose them. And, um, and Jason Diltz was like, okay, yeah. And he was about to reverse engineer it. And then I see Jason go outside, to, outside to the, to the um, living room, and I see my sister Miranda like on Jason Dilt's arm, sad, like she was, like sad, like she was looking over me, sad, like she knew something was going on, but she didn't know what. You know what I mean? And she she was sad that I was getting hacked. And then um, Jason Dilt's my Jason Dilt's hand was right there, and my sister was on her his arm, like on her sho- on his shoulder, like sad with these puppies, like sad eyes. And then anyways, I leave the house and I'm leaving the house, right? I go out to the house and I see, uh, I, I go to the road, right? And I'm about to walk somewhere. I don't know where. And then, um, and then, um, um, and then, um, what's it called? Um, and then, um, what's it called? Uh, And then, um, what's it called? Uh, I go out to the road and I see this big old van. It's like a big old hefty van. 
it's not like an alkal uh alconoline van it was like a when you, you know it kind of looks like the um the amazon trucks the amazon prime vans but with windows on the side so um i see this big old dark gray van pull out of the next house which was like the cartel or the gang member's house and he pulls out the car or pulls out the house they're pulling out and they're about to drive away but they stop they see me right when they stop i thought they were about to shoot me and i so i put my hand in my pocket getting ready and right or i grab my phone something like that and uh and um my tv just flashed on right now it just flashed on and no one pressed nothing it was completely off not completely off but it was on the screen and it flashed off at 147 <laughs> i'm talking about the hackers and then the hackers make my tv go flash on and off you see that shit i can't make this shit up but anyways um anyways uh 147 my tv tripped out right now went to the screen where i'm gonna put to the menu but anyways um anyways uh i, I go to the street and um they're letting me know that they're listening to me <laughs> but anyways i go to the street and um that van pulls out of that house next to me the gang member cartel house or whatever and then he pulls a uh, they they stop they look at me it had all black tinted windows a dark gray van a dark dark gray big old back part almost bigger than the amazon trucks it's like almost like a, it kind of looked like an ambulance type truck but all dark gray with black tinted windows you can't even see through the windows they pull up right there and they slow down and they stop right there and they look at me i grab my phone and i grab put my hand in my pocket ready to go to war or whatever and then um then i just post up right there and they just slowly drive by me and then they take off and i'm standing right there watching them they go down a little ways down the, the street and um and uh and they go down a little ways and then they turn they bust a, a u-turn and they were kind of come back i start walking back to the house when i look over to the house that i just came from without had jason and my sister in it all the whole house around it was flooded with water was flooded with water it looked like it got flooded with water all dirty water and i go into the house and i there was two little um islands in that water right that didn't flood that were higher on the ground higher elevation so it didn't get in the water so i hop in the i hop on the first one it's long and i hop on the second one and i go back in the house um but it was trippy it was a trippy dream um and then right now my my tv tripped out my tv always does that and I never knew why, but now we know why. Well, I already knew it was hackers anyway, so I haven't tripping. <laughs> but yeah, but but yeah, so I have been hacked in real life. I got proof of it, and I got proof that you know, I mean, it's reboot computers because when I went in there acting funny, they took my receipt when I told them I have the original sheet, not to give my computer to nobody, so they took it. Da 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 da. And then I had, you know, I mean, I then I had like I have a whole bunch of a whole bunch of evidence. I just haven't went to the police or haven't went to turn it in but it's still hacked so that means they're still operating in that crime <laughs>